Hi guys, welcome back. I'm Fab. And today I'm doing my coloring book haul. <laughs> ten books. I thought it was more, but only ten. So let's, oh, take a look. Color some cuteness, pretty blossoms pocket size. And gets right into it. These are really cute. They are grayscale. And being pocket size, it uh, makes it really easy to color them. These are going to be fun. It reminds me a lot of um, friendship. Pretty big. And I think it's Black River Art. Yep, Black River Art. Lots of good stuff in there. It's going to be fun. So there's that one. Also, from Black River Art, Fine Art Grayscale 2, pocket size. And uh, I am not too sure about this one, but I wanted something other than just cutesy, you know? So, we shall see about this. Also grayscale, papers, you know, then smooth. Same thing with this one. Sorry, I forgot to tell you. Pretty much just Amazon paper. I really like the classical pictures so all right that's that one we will see how it goes and then for my supporting Hannah Carlson I bought the seasons coloring book A little practical help the page color is cream it's double-sided paper is pretty thick though from what I've seen of other people doing this, it's a, it takes water, okay? Haven't colored in it yet, even though I've had it a while. I've been really busy doing other pages. So I am looking forward to trying this. I've seen so many people doing this book that I'm going to feel a little bit imitated because they're better than I am. Ain't that the truth? Okay. Black River Art. I am on a roll with Black River Art. Oodles of animals. These are a lot bigger. Also grayscale. Make me think of watercolor more than uh, markers. Definitely not pencils. I wouldn't even try doing this with pencils. But yeah, I like these pictures. That's nice. That's a really nice little detail. Looks like just a splash of water, but it's a fishy. Yeah, this is going to be an interesting one if, if I can do it. Paper is quite cheap, but it is single sided, so you should get away with just putting the paper in between. Just a little bit off white, not quite fully white. Yeah, definitely a watercolor book. So there's that. Next up. 
Stetania Bogme Stov Stolova Stol Stolova Stolova. Yeah, I can see that. Nice little town Valentine's Day. I'd gotten this for Valentine's and then totally forgot I had it. Not sure. Not sure. It's not something that looks like I would normally do. That's not a bad thing. It's just going to be new to me. Oh dear. So paper is just a little bit off-white, very thin, single-sided Amazon paper. Next up is a big one. Enchanted Animals, Adult Coloring Book, Deluxe Edition, Special Art. Single-sided, slightly grayed out paper, quite thin. Hmm. That would be interesting if you could make it look like glass or, or china or something like that. I like this one. I like that it faded out a couple, gave you a little bit of depth like that. They are single sided with a black back. Paper is slightly gray, quite thin. But you know what? That's interesting. That looks interesting. I think I'm going to like this one, but we'll find out. I think uh, we'll find out how markers do with it. Yeah, we'll see. Also another large one, also special art, Enchanted World Deluxe Edition. Oh, this puppy is big. Oh my goodness, same kind of stuff. Hopefully not duplicates. Lots of tigers, lots of cats. Butterfly Girl. I kind of like this style. This is really interesting. I wonder what it's called. What kind of style is this? Back when I was doing art, like drawing art, this is what I used to kind of do. That's going back too many years. Maybe it's a uh, Art Nouveau kind of style. I don't know. I don't know what you'd call it. But it's pretty. So that one. Oh, the other one was this fat too. That's a big book. Our next one. Secret. Secret. What? I can't speak today. Marriage. Marriage is but what is together today. All right, Secret Twilight Garden Coloring Book Midnight Edition. Which means it has a black background. They are single-sided. Pages are really thin. That's different. sure if I'm going to like this one. We shall see. Yeah, did I say the paper is pretty thin? It is. It is pretty thin. You know what? This would be a good thing for my new um, pens, my glitter pens. That might work. Hmm. 
Next up, Linda Ravenscroft Fairy and Fantasy Art Painting and Coloring Book 4. 300 GSM paper for professional artist finish. And it is signed. Got it off her website. And these are, of course, they are absolutely gorgeous. Look at that. That is cardstock. That's practically a piece of plywood. Holy cow. I'm sure you recognize these pictures because I do. Oh. So the color is slightly cream. It's one sided. Very, very heavy paper. And beautiful drawings. So looking forward to this. I am not intimidated. I am not. Intimidated. I am so intimidated. And I also got Linda Ravenscroft Nachi Fairies 1 Painting and Coloring Book, yada yada. Same thing. Also signed. Thank you, dear. Appreciate it. The Bad Apple Fairy. <laughs> Man, has she got attitude. Yeah, look at just look at that paper, my goodness. I'm not used to this. Even when I had professional watercolor paper, it was nothing like this. But then I was cheap, so. The Dryad and the Green Man. Just beautiful work. I am the I'm Bored Fairy. Yeah, I can practically see the model in this. She really well done. Just gorgeous. Aha, the Rose Thorn Fairy prickly on the outside. Yeah, these are these are just gorgeous. Just gorgeous. Okay, that's it. That's all the books I got this month. It is actually a lot. It's going to take me a while to get to these. And uh, I hope you uh, enjoyed looking at them. If you want a flip through on any of these, give me a shout out. I will do that for you. All right, guys. Have a great day. Thank you for watching. Bye.